Um, obviously, it's a story of two halves, I think, in this game. Um, really proud of just our resiliency in the second half. I mean, I challenged the kids at halftime to just come out and play harder. I thought that Rice outplayed us in the first half, and I thought that we uh, were not very focused on our game plan. And as a result, we got into a huge hole. Uh, but credit to our players. They could have easily just, you know, quit or said, you know, whatever. But they came back out and um, really play, played well in the second half. And quite honestly, I think if there was three more minutes in this game, we could have won the game. Um, but that, that's our fault. You know, we have to be better for 40 minutes. And I think that's kind of been the theme of this team uh, for much of the season. Like, we can put together great spurts where we look really good. And then um, we lose that team for a couple minutes. And teams are too good. They go, I mean, they, it's too good at this level. When you play at this level, if you're, if you're bad for two to three minutes, that spurt, it's over. And, you know, that consistency, we just don't, we just haven't grasped yet. Um, and, uh, you know, we just got to keep working. And we're going to keep working and um, continue to find that team that can put together 40 minutes of a, of a game. Really happy for the effort we've seen from Nye recently. I think um, everybody that knows her game knows that she's back. Um, you know, all non-conference, I've said this many times, she was not healthy. And you could see it. You know, a lot of people would say, what's going on with Nye? And, you know, we, did, we don't disclose injuries. We don't disclose things like that to her privacy. But um, she's healthy again, and you can see a difference. So if Nye continues to play like that, uh, we're going to be in good shape. But, you know, again, we, got, we, got to, we have to do a better job um, offensively of being able to score when uh, people put four people on her because that's what happened. And, uh, you know, going 0 for 11 from the three doesn't help us. So that's skill work, um, and that's us continuing to put our heads together so that we can uh, put up a better effort on the offensive end. But, um, you know, again, good things in this game. we got to build on the good things. Yeah, I mean, we were really disappointed with the rebounds at halftime because we felt, you know, when you look at the game on paper, we felt like that was an area we could win. And, you know, you're going into halftime and we're losing that battle. So that was really disappointing. Uh, the team, you know, knew it before I had to say it. And uh, so we knew to have a chance in this game, we'd ha we have to win what we think we can win. And we thought we could win the boards. So they did a fantastic job of that. Obviously, the old boards were incredible. But I thought the hustle plays also were the loose balls in the second half. I mean, we got on the floor quick and we got a lot of loose balls that they didn't get. And that was a difference in us being able to come back in this game. Yeah, um, it was an exciting moment, of course, you know, my first start. Uh, I was just thankful for the opportunity and thankful that uh, coach and staff trusted me enough to go out and do that. So I just wanted to come out and play hard. Yeah, like that's uh, that's what uh, coach and they look for me to do that the most. You know, that's what I really, really bring to the team. So I feel like that's, that's important for me to go out there and do that because that's what they need from me. Yeah, um, you know, that's been an ongoing conversation with her. Uh, we would love for her to shoot the three a little bit more. Um, because she's very capable of doing that. That's just not her thought process, right? Uh, Laya is naturally a playmaker first, a scorer second. So, um, you know, we've t we told her going into this year, for us to have any success, we needed you to sh score, right? And so you've seen a big uptick in her production scoring-wise, but it's more pull-ups and to the basket. Um, I think that we'd love to see her add that part to the game, but that's just kind of the next part for her. Yeah, I mean, I thought we came out in the second half and we did what we were supposed to do. I mean, honestly, at halftime, there wasn't a lot of adjustments made because when you don't perform well in the game plan, you, there's nothing to adjust yet. So we kind of said, look, let's scratch it, like throw the first half out and let's do what we're supposed to do. And then we can see where to go from there. Um, and, uh, and I just felt generally we played harder, you know. And, you know, some of that is I think we get – uh, discouraged. You know, it's tough when you're fighting through um, inconsistency, that when you make a mistake, you make a mistake, you make a mistake, we get discouraged. And we have to get better about having mental toughness through that. And, you know, I thought in the second half that the times that they made a big shot, you know, end of the shot clock, or we gave up something we shouldn't have, we came back the next time and were more determined to get a stop. And I haven't seen that out of our team uh, consistently this year.